curious about the armor because it looks freaking cool. Armors of the witches who bore the profane flame now herald spirits of Irithel. The witches who led the pontiff's knights were originally ordained as holy knights. It was not long, however, before their hearts were swallowed by the profane flame. Higher physical resistance. And it looks freaking cool. Don't I have the legs already, too? Somewhere around here. Do 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 do. What? What? Remind myself really quick. What's called Fire Witch? Fire Witch. And it was where on the list? Just past thorns. I'm, gl I'm glad they sort of sort things consistently, so you can tell where the hell some stuff are. I don't think I have Fire Witch, unless I'm crazy. It must have been. It wasn't the helm. It was the gloves. It wasn't antiquated. All right. I'm crazy. Maybe I got the armor twice, I don't remember. <laughs> Let's not dwell on it for too long. So those guys are dangerous. I have trouble specifically with the ones that have shields. Because I can just stab the shit out of the ones that don't have shields, but the ones that have shields are problematic. Where are they going? Gotta be a little careful about where they choose to patrol. Let's see. Gotta be a head wrap that just fits a little better. That's better. That's better. Oh, it's too heavy though. There we go. When in doubt, wear something cleric-y. Oh, they're coming back. Ooh, there we- th that's exactly what I kind of hoped would happen. One of them just aggroed on me. It is the shield one, though, so they're gonna be- they might be a bit of a problem for me. This spell can't go through walls, right? Because it hit a wall before? No, come back here. Come back! Come back! Come back! Yeah, the other one still hasn't noticed me. This is perfect. Please continue to not notice me correctly. Hey, friend. Boom! Significantly easier. There we go. Let's go track the other one down before they become a problem for me. 22,000 souls already. Wow. This place doles it out, huh? Hit. Don't mind me. Oh. Hoo -hoo. Oh, the range of that thing still surprises me. Counter-attack damage, buddy. Yeah. So I got a ring that specifically uh, rewards me for attacking repeatedly, which is what this specializes in. Because as far as attack speed goes, I'm one step below a dagger right now. And I have counter-attack damage, because it's just that's just how this weapon type works. That is totally going to run me into a trap, and I'm totally going to fall for it. Because I want it. What do you have? Nope. Come back here. You little son of a bitch. Come on! There we go. There we go. That was iffy as all hell. Alright, Twinkly Titanite. Someone's freaking out. There's an item down there. Let's see. Alright, there's numerous items down there. Oh, I'm... Oh, hey, bad guy. Can't plunging attack him, can I? Nope. There's no cliffs to jump off here. And down there is the thing that's screaming a lot. What is that? Oh, it's just one of those witch ladies. It's one of those weird witch ladies that shoots bleed spells at me. That seems to be where the sound's coming from. Wonder if something specific's happening to her. Hidden path ad? What? <laughs> the fuck? Wait, was that... Did I just attack a rail and an entire staircase spawned? Was that there a second ago at all? That's... Okay, that... I don't think this has ever happened before in a Souls game. That really messed with me. Okay. Hey, buddy. Oh, you don't even have a shield, huh? I'll make you feel better. I, oh, you're, you're standing still because you're supposed to, you're scripted to try to ambush me. That's cute. Ow. 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 Ow, ow, stop it. My organs. I like them on, si on the inside. Try a ranged battle. Nah, I killed him already, it's fine. More large titanite. Trying to make sure that you have what you need. Oh, try ranged battle against that? I mean, is there something special going on here? Because it's, it's just a witch as far as I can tell, and there's something crazy is going on here. I mean, I don't really want to hop down right now. So, I guess, yeah, why not? 
What's your deal? Is it gonna like explode into souls? Like what's his deal? Is it just the same thing it always was? What's your deal? Ow. Oh, she's durable, ain't she? Judge! Got her. Ooh. Dorfie's nine. Is that her spell? Is that why she was more effective? Witch tree branch. Oh. Is this another place where the, the archer guy would have helped? Maybe not. It was witch tree instead of white tree, right? That's different, I think. Where's the branches at? Where are my branches? Yeah, that's a young white tr branch. That was a witch tree branch. It's probably a weapon, actually. For, like, casting item? Yep. The branch of a large, well-tended witch tree used as a sorcery catalyst. Witch tree staves are customary in the far north and allow for faster casting than ordinary catalysts. Steady chant, the usual. Then there was also the new spell. Make our way over here. Summon great insects swarm to feast on foes. It's a miracle. Gross. Miracle of Dor- Oh, it's Dorhees. Or something like that. The deranged evangelist. Summons great insect swarm to feast on foes. Those who linger too long in the brink of the deep will often slip. Doris is sure to have wallowed in this darkness intoxicated by its peril. Gross. That'll be a fun toy to play with later on, huh? When I get my, uh... Oh, let's go ahead and ember, by the way. Now that I'm not dying constantly. We got past that lizard. So I'll go ahead and enable myself to be invaded by players. Or, uh... Let's see... I'll go ahead and join the Way of the Blue, though. It's just more eventful when a bunch of people invade. Cause I would like to, I would like, I would totally love to create one of those situations where I get invaded, then get counter invaded, then we get double invaded, and we have like a two on two. Like having that in the middle of a playthrough would be really fun. So I'm, I'm gonna see if that encourages that situation happening. But uh, mainly I'm opening myself up to be, being potentially invaded by NPCs, which is the more interesting thing, because they're unique encounters, one-time things. Totally missable, and often have unique items, like the fume sword and whatever the guy's ring was. Oh, this whiteout snow makes me nervous, because the whiteout snow makes me think I'm going to walk past an item without noticing it, which is totally a risk. All right. <laughs> the, oh, dark spirit Sir Locke. I don't I have no idea how to tell if that's a player or not, too. It happened right when I was walking in here, which makes it seem almost scripted. We'll just have to judge by the way he behaves. Is he up here? By the... He's not by the gem. Oh, nope. He's a mad spirit. <laughs> Are we gonna fight? Or not? He's rolling! Who likes to parry? Very proud of his, his potential parries, isn't he? <laughs> this is fun. Nope, there it goes. Yep. Very proud of his potential parries. Make me. Oh, come on! Well, now you're just getting it. Now you're getting a heal. I guess maybe he healed when this blue sentinel came in. I didn't notice that at first because I was a little distracted. He's a mound maker. Well, this immediately panned out. <laughs> like the moment I did this, the encounter I was hoping for happened. <laughs> I just kind of want to watch it, honestly. Two on one's just kind of boring. Fight for me, champion! Oh, he's going after the NPCs. Oh, that's probably dangerous. That's a fire guy and other things. <laughs> he's trying to lead us to a dangerous enemy. <laughs> I'm hoping we get double invaded soon. Oh, here comes the bad guys. 
Here comes the bad guys. Ow. Yep. Keep fighting, guys. I'll do this part. Roll! Well, this is eventful. How's my sentinel doing? Oh, crap. We're under attack. Uh, lightning gem. Hey! <laughs> well, the guy got what he wanted. Ouch! Oh, no, there's another one. Well, that's not good. They're still fighting out. This has gotten dramatic. Oh, no. How many guys did you get to bring in here? <laughs> what a giant fucking mess. There we go. <laughs> For me, I hardly care what's even fair or not in this encounter. I'm just interested in seeing things play out. Dude, this is eventful. <laughs> Are we both using rapiers? I can't tell. We might be using the same equipment, practically. In fact, he looks like he's wearing the same armor I was wearing until a moment ago. There we go. I'm mostly taking out the ads that go after him. <laughs> Smile, you're on camera, guys. He keeps running backwards over and over again. The fire guy's a problem right now. Oh! That's bad. And he's trying to team up. Alright, yeah, he's trying to go for the host. Who's a big ol' nasty? Here it comes! Oh! He's leaving! What? Oh, is he leaving because he killed the other inv invader? Is that how that works? I have no idea. Well, that was eventful. Huh. Oh, shit! <laughs> Hi! Come on out, buddy! Am I being attacked from behind somewhere? <laughs> wow, that was, that was a fun little sequence of nonsense. Got my lightning gem. Which is good for your... That's supposed to be good for your... Uh, a miracle-based build, because it scales with... Your lightning scales with faith or something. But, you know, but I just... I have such a good setup right here. Hey. Pay attention to me. <laughs> Dirty backstepper. There we go. Wow. Yeah, that was fun. That's exactly what I was hoping. Yeah, I, I don't like doing two on two, two on one, so when I get when I get a co-op invader, I mostly want to see them fight the uh invader while I try to counter the fact that the invader's totally gonna use the environment against us. And we'll just have this fun, crazy in in environment. And he seemed to take the opportunity to focus on his co-op partner in those moments. The, my co-op partner was probably like, What the fuck? Why is this guy helping me? Or something. I don't know. Everyone reacts differently to things. But that was fun. That was good. That was a good little thing to record, I think. <laughs> Nothing here? It's just kind of a dead end? Oh, you can drop down to here. Maybe you have to drop down to here if you go wherever that is. Right, let's just do, let's, The central path is so obvious, we'll take the side path first. Oh, I say that, but it's a Dark Souls game, so of course, the si the side path is going to be the one that goes directly to the boss, whereas the it's not open from the side. The way these games always work is that the side path goes directly to the boss, or the la later stuff, and the the obvious path is the one that goes uh to a dead end you can't open anyway. What's around here? Ooh, white tree. Is this the same one from earlier? Nope. There's items around here that I've missed previously. Bonfire. Hello. Let's grab that item real quick, though. Hidden behind the staircase. On the Oh, it's, this is on the way in. There's a ton of overlapping and, and inter intertwining paths around here. More large titanite. Can't go around there. Hit! Nope, that is, an, that is as wally as invisible walls get. And I'm not talking about a space robot. Oh, wait. Wally wasn't in space. He was on Earth. That was the twist. Wait, was it a twist? I don't remember. I don't remember if it was a twist. Hey! Is that her? 
I believe that's our friend right there. Let's have a rest, because my poor, poor uh, Estus flasks have been taken away by PvP invasion. Oh, I thought it might be you. Good to see you. I never managed to find Horus. But my duty must be done, even alone, as an unkindled Lord Seeker. For the children I knew, bless their souls. We all have our reasons, don't we? Ah, you are brave indeed to face your duty alone. I would do well to learn from you. May the flames guide your way. Ah, I'd make. Quiet resolve. Is that a fun little animation? Got the patches squat. <laughs> The toast. My thanks. There's fun little animations here. Yeah, kind of like all of these. I probably won't use. I probably won't use my thanks. What does my resolve look like? Or quite resolve? <laughs> that is silly. Oh, I'm so badass! And you can see through the top of my helmet when that happens. And I don't appear to have a face inside that helmet either. It's just a burning something. They don't they don't render her face inside there. Alright, so she's here on a mission, and now her 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 help is gone. So it's all up to her. Proof of the Concord kept. What the Alright. I guess we'll find out. It's not a key item. Oh right, we got the new gem by the way. Lightning gem. If you use Titanite, found in the aftermath of dragon hunts. I used infusion to create lightning weapons. Lightning weapons uh, inflicted lightning damage and scale with faith. I'm always surprised when there's certain items in this game that have super, super explicit descriptions. Ooh, proof of Concord kept. Proof of a dark spirit was felled by a blue sentinel. So this is their home or something? Th that's an E. That's an ear. Gross. A blood-drained shrunken ear. Souvenir taken for subduing the guilty. The knights called the Blades of the Dark Moon punish the guilt-soaked defenders of the gods and take this as proof of their conquest. The earless corpses of the guilty will be left behind as a warning to others, inspiring both fear and respect of the gods, such as the eternal mandate of the Dark Sun. So... Huh. But it's proof that someone was killed by a blue sentinel. So what we're getting here is very explicit evidence that the Blue Sentinels are some- have a direct relationship to the- the Dark Moon Covenant of Dark Souls 1. For those of you that don't know, in Dark Souls 1, you get to the- and Orlando, and you find out that Gwendolyn is an illusion if you do- if you choose to attack her. Turns out, oh, Gwendolyn's a crazy illusion being maintained by her brother, because she's actually not even in this country or whatever the hell. And, uh, as a result, uh, the entire- the- it turns out the sun is also an illusion, and Orlando goes dark, and you just get repeatedly invaded by members of the Dark Moon Covenant for your betrayal of Anne Orlando, or something along those lines. Welcome. And so it's- it's the- it's the- it's, uh, the equivalent of, like, a Rat Covenant, or the Blue Sentinels, like, all these other covenants where you invade people in a certain region. You, well. you just- if you make it dark in Anne Orlando and you're online, you'll just get continually invaded by those people. Wow! Wow. Alright, yeah, we've hit the point where I can get 31,000 souls and level up once from it. It's always a surprise to me when the uh, things really ramp up. So, how, what is dexterity? Whoa! One point of dexterity gives me three damage right now. That is no joke. But I, I do need some more stamina, though. So, I want to get to at least 20 endurance, I think. And then I'll probably go back to dexterity. Anyway, my requirement was around 17. Is around 17,000? Oh wow, that's probably... Yep, that's that should be enough. Welcome, very and we'll get one more... piece of... Yeah, there we go. Now we're up to 108 stamina. That'll help me do more consecutive attacks without getting stuck. And I currently have basically no soul, so that was about as perfect as that transaction could work out. I'm interested in getting this full set because it looks pretty cool. Although it's probably heavy. And the pants don't match at all right now. <laughs> Dark leggings probably work better. Not not necessarily, they're also too heavy. That's the evil covenant. Pontiff Knight. 70% 70, 70 Oh, that looks perfect. And I fat roll. The, apparently the moment you hit 70, you fat roll. Alright. Antiquated gloves. 
The antiquated gloves look roughly what you'd look like there. There we go. Call me the Mirror Knight, apparently. There's some... <laughs> this is just the stabbiest looking armor. It's just covered in corners everywhere. Such, this is just hazardous to children. I feel like... <laughs> kind of demeans the pose a little bit, doesn't it? <laughs> you have to stand back up to sit down? Oh, he cancels it. Alright, well... PvP happened today. 